assalamu alaikum everyone welcome to another vlog so today we are going to create by my look itself what are you guessing a winter fall makeup so we wait for a winter season to come i know it's extremely cold during those season but winter fall makeup is my one of my favorite makeup because when you apply a makeup you are not afraid of having that heat in the summer and you will just destroy your makeup and when you go out you wear a nice and cozy dress of course you would you want to look a glamorous too isn't it there you go so i had just create a small effort to bring out a new uh, techniques of winterfall makeup which is kind of uh, soft smoky eyes with the bold lips so to achieve this look just watch till the end and if you haven't subscribed to my channel what are you doing take a moment subscribe to my channel turn the notifications on so you'll get notified of my upcoming videos and you can be a part of as a squad family so without further ado let's jump to the tutorial this is my first impression on this product so let's jump to the primer yeah so i can see that this primer is pretty well hydrate my skin and it gives me that natural uh, glow like a dewy effect kind of thing so and i can see that it gives that plump effect to your skin so on my t-zone area i'm going to apply this pore beneficial primer So this area I need that glow and this area I need that uh, what you call this area I need that mattifying effect so that my nose does not get greasy and oily after makeup kind of little breakout so I tend to have little spots so I'm just going to hide the spots erase the spots it's not like I'm erasing permanently but we're going to do everything with the makeup so to erase that spot i'm going to use this nyx concealer which is in the shade orange exactly. yeah. so i think i'm going to use my finger for this so that i don't apply more product I'm applying this orange concealer under my eyes too and I'm just going to blend with this Zuviva brush. Now that we conceal the face, so for the foundation I'm going to use this LA Pro Cover Foundation, LA Girl and uh, this says that it's HD definition long wear illuminating foundation so let's see how much illuminating it is so I'm just going to take a little bit on my wrist I'm just going to try with this two pumps let's see how does it blend I'm going to start it from this area because it is a luminous effect and it is it is a buildable uh, coverage so we'll get to know in one coat how does it look like oh this is a bit lighter shade because this happens when you choose the shade online omg one side of the face it's uh, kind of red tone and one is like a paint so let's see i'm not going to take more products i'm just going to go blend with the same product itself but i wanted to first experience the luminous effect of this foundation so i'll just blend well this first so it looks something like this after blending that uh, lighter shade 
and this is the bare face which has no foundation so I'll just show it to you it looks not that bad it's pretty nice but still it's not matching my neck so we'll work it out so this is how it looks after a complete blend it's pretty wide for me and also I just bring it little down to the neck and I still see that it's not matching so I'm just going to go above the ears it has a pretty nice luminous effect I think if I would have choose the right shade which is little darker tone it could be more nicer but uh, overall it's so dewy look and it's nice glowy for the people who have a dry skin it's amazing for them now just to get my shade I'm going to mix up little bit my Oda Beauty foundation because it's a pretty high coverage I don't want to go so much product on my face so I will just take a little bit and I'm going to take in the blender and blend it only on my cheek because we'll be coming up with the concealer itself so I don't want it to be look white and white so I'm going to do my brows so let's switch to our powder based brow which is my favorite from Bob So let's move on to eyeshadow, not move on to eyeshadow, who will conceal, who will highlight the brows. So I'll just highlight the brows in front of you, I'll show it to you how do I highlight my brow. So I have to remove the contacts, uh, let's see, it was just having that discomfort so I'm going to use this MAC Studio Fix and I'm going to apply it all over my lid to create that base. I think before I create the base I think I'll go a little bit with the concealer on my lid so that whatever shadows we are applying it will be more pop out. So now that we apply the concealer on the lid, I'm just going to set up So firstly I'm going to take this shade which is off balance This is kind of mauve shade So I will see how does it go and I'm going to start off with my crease And now I'm going to go on the top of this in the shade with this shade called Karma.
now i'm going to use this shade which is pretty brown from makeup revolution palette and i'm going to go over my crease with a very lighter hand i'm just going to create that crease Now I create that uh, smoke edge on my both the eyes. It's not that much, but it's just a tiny because we're going to do a winter fall makeup. So I wanted to keep it more classic and the bold lips. So I'm going to go with this shade from the Huda Beauty. This is called Frazzle, and I'm going to apply it on my finger and I'm going to apply it on my lid with the finger. It's very nice beautiful shape so now i'm going to tight line with this cold pencil from mina So I'm going to use this eyeshadow for the eyeliner which is pretty nice with the golden shimmer in it. It's black. So I'm going to apply this concealer on my eyes. So for the contour, I'm using this Maybelline stick in the shade MNY3005. So for contour, I'm using this brush. This is from Zueva, and it is such amazing. Oh, what a blending! For the loose powder, I'm going to use this Maybelline Studio Maybelline Fit Me. I'm just going to set my under eye.
so for the under eye i'm going to use this shade which is karma now i'm going to go with this green shade which is in the shade mercury which is right here all right now i'm just going to take this liner from mena and tight line this line so now we're going to do contour for the contour i'm using this mac palette and i'm going to use this shade which is kind of grayish tone so i'm going to go with this nars I'm using this NARS blush which is like a super creamy it's in the shade Dolce Vita and I'm going to take a tiniest amount on my hand which is this much and let's see how does it spread with the blender so I'm using this blender which is the cleaner side I'm using I think I'll better use this more clean so I'm just going to go a little bit it's always very like very pigmented so make sure you always go lighter and then you can build it up now for the highlighter i'm going to use this from the mac which is called double glam and i'm going to apply on the high like the pointed of my cheeks just this and i'm going right my brow bone now for the lipstick i'm going to use first i'm going to use this lip liner which is from the mac and in the shade burgundy and now i'm going to use this lipstick which is again from the mac it's called glam viva So this is it we just forgot to apply a mascara to our lower lashes which i completely forgot about it and i'm so sorry Now i want to just uh experiment something with the bold lips so i'm using this makeup revolution in the shade salvation this one this is pretty dark shade which is very good for winter fall makeup and i'm on i want to see how does it look oh it's pretty dark i'm a nude person completely and i never use such a dark shade other than red but this is my first time so as we finish our look we going to spray it with little 
fragrance on us. <sighs> I just cannot resist without perfume. And now my favorite, what did I do just? I just wipe it really. So now my favorite is this which is my go-to fragrance and I'm loving this fragrance so much. This is from Azza. Hope you guys enjoy this fragrance. Go check it out on Azza Fashion and let me just talk more about my look, how we create this look. So here is a bold lips. I never tried such lips. I'm just really loving it and it is a winter fall makeup. Hope you guys enjoy. Yes, Saidi. Um, next time I'll do the tutorials in. Try to do it in Arabic. My um, Arabic is it's not that fluent, but inshallah I will try my level best. Hope you guys enjoy this look. This is called winter fall look, and for this look, please go command. How you create your winter look and tag me on my instagram so i'll just see how you create your ones and hope you guys enjoy stay safe please subscribe to our channel and yalla <laughs>